Hello everybody, it's your Uncle 79, the Spiritual Savage, here to bring you another message today. Please make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, select the all options so that you know when all my uploads upload, you feel me? Let's get some thanks to the Most High God for bringing us here for this message, okay? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks, Dad. Show some gratitude today, you know? Um, I work for the Most High God. You feel me? I don't work for none of you motherfuckers. I don't. I don't give a fuck if I'm a YouTube partner or not. I work for the Most High God. I'm on assignment from God. I'm not on an assignment for any of you fucking karmics, narmics, or otherwise. You feel me? I mean that shit. Like me or not, I don't give a fuck. Okay? If I got messages to deliver, I'm going to deliver the messages. And they make it to the right people. Okay? Let's get that straight walk on by okay confirmation we're gonna pull some I want to do let's get at what's happening now some karmic emperor and I told you Aries I don't I don't get it Aries somebody this is Aries to somebody it could be an Aries Aries it ain't even got to be no masculine. But some Aries in their, in their toxic masculinity is doing some fucking magic. Can't make it up. So there's an Aries, a karmic Aries doing some karmic shit right now. Okay? They're aggressively like moving forward with this magic. That's what's happening now. So let's get some energy on this. Let's pull some um, somebody, somebody. Please make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Select the all options so that you know when all my uploads upload. You feel me? What's up, baby? <clears throat> I just heard something. People stay testing God, you know, and they're going to get stung. Somebody's pissy. Somebody's trying to hide, too, with the ostrich, you know, put their head underneath the ground. Somebody's somebody's going to get stung, and then they're going to go hide. This Aries energy. And again, this doesn't have to be an Aries. This just represents the fact that somebody, well, no, this is an Aries. They're doing it now. It's a fucking Aries, okay? Jeez Louise. Let's get some energy on this Aries. Who is, tell me who this somebody is. Holy Spirit. Okay, Metatron. What up, dog? Who is this Aries? Somebody who lies about their age. Somebody's a motherfucking savage. This person is in a savage energy. Somebody's plotting on you, okay? Libra, somebody's a Libra. Could be a Libra, or this is somebody eh, fucking trying to plot on you uh, with the justice system. Somebody's a Scorpio trying to put an ending on you. Somebody's doing magic on you. I can't make it up. Somebody's a dark witch, so we're talking about possibly a feminine. Somebody's a Sagittarius, or possibly an earth angel. So what do we have here? Okay. Somebody's lying about their age. Somebody's lying about how old they are. This person's a fucking savage and not in a good way either. Okay? This person is very savage right now. Like, don't give a fuck. Alexa, what's the definition of savage? Savage is defined as extremely violent, wild, or frightening, or very serious or cruel. It can also be used to describe an uncivilized human being. Savagery refers to the state or quality of being savage, which can be measured by how violent or cruel someone or something is. Thank you. Anytime. Literally. Hope you're having a good weekend. 
I am. So this person is is very violent right now. Okay, very aggressive. That's Aries energy. That's you know a savage. Really, when we when we think about savage, somebody who's a savage, like in in that way, that's that's Aries energy. That is an Aries. And anybody know Aries out there? When Aries is upset, they know. And listen, it, you might as well get the fuck out of the way. They a ram, not a, you know. They a ram. Is that Taurus? Taurus is the ram. Aries is the what is the fucking Aries? It's a goat or some shit, ain't it? Got horns on it. I don't know. But they're forceful, violent, aggressive, angry. This person's angry right now. Okay. This person is, a, is in, in, in a bad savage energy. They, they, somebody's a Scorpio. This person got Scorpio in their chart, but they want to take you out. I'm picking up on the fact they're doing some type of death magic. This kind of magic. I can't make it. Somebody's doing magic on you. Okay? Somebody's plotting on you. This person has plotted or is plotting. You're a Sagittarius. Okay? They, this person could also have Sagittarius in their chart. But nonetheless, the Sagittarius reminds it's an earth angel. Somebody's a dark witch. Somebody's trying to do something to balance out the scales or they're doing something illegal or they're trying to do something within the legal system. Okay? Uh, Spirit just said, what's the tea? So grab what's the tea. Ah, uh, what the hell? This is one more horror oracle. Because this is some, this is some. They said scary. Now, I don't know if you should be afraid or scared. I don't, you know, if you believe, if you, if you have faith in the most. But you don't have to be, in order to be brave, you don't have to be scared. This person could scare you. Or whatever this person is doing could be considered scary. This person could be scary. You ever met somebody who's scary when they're angry? I've been told that I'm scary when I'm angry too. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't sitting around doing dark magic on motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? When I'm mad and shit. I may cuss your ass out. You know, if you put your hands on me, I'm going to hit you back or fuck you up. Okay? But nonetheless, this, this magic that's being sent out. Now, see, this is the thing. Now, when we talk about doing return to senders, what I've learned is that once you reach a very specific level uh, towards your north node or when you know that you are... Um, you ask the, the Holy Spirit, you've asked God to, to uh, you know, dress you in his armor. You don't have to worry. It's like an automatic return to sender. So don't even worry about it. I mean, you don't want that kind of karma come because whatever energy you send out will come back to you. That's why I always suggest if you are going to send it out, send it with some love and light because, it, you know, it's karma. What we send out does come back to us. Even if it's even even if, you know, we're defending ourselves, you know. There's a way to do it, I guess. I can't tell anybody. I just always say send it with love and light. Whatever you do, always move in love and light. Even when you're angry, move in love and light. If that makes sense to me. If you, if you know, you know. You feel me? Let's get a horror oracle card out here. This person obviously got some issues. Okay? I just saw a fly. Haven't really. I, there's a ladybug in my window. And there's a fly flying around. There was a fly and a ladybug in my house last year at the same time. And, and the fly kept fucking with the ladybug, so I just killed the fly. Okay? <laughs> That's what happened. You feel me? Alright. I'm still smelling that fume. Those fumes. And I've, you know, I've smelled it in way too many different places to think that it's, you know, could be somebody doing something everywhere I go, but I doubt it. I think that that's just my clear sentience or whatever the hell some type of clear okay that i have that i smell danger somebody's doing something very dangerous sending dangerous danger your way or my way i'm not worried about it just not the most pleasant smell it doesn't stink but it's pungent this person means it this person is obsessed with you okay obsession phantom of the opera This person's obsessed with you, okay? This person's obsessed with you. Let's get the... I, I've never seen the Phantom of the Opera. So, Alexa, what's the Phantom of the Opera about? The Phantom of the Opera is a story that takes place in a Paris opera house in the 1880s. A mysterious figure known as the Phantom haunts the opera house, and he is loved by a young soprano named Christine. He was gross too, wasn't he? Yeah, this person sits behind the shadows, obsessed with you. 
This person could. I just <laughs> shit. This person, uh, you know, the the mask. This person could have had some type of uh, work done. Okay. This person has had some type of face augmentation. The quote. I have brought you here, Five Cellars Underground, because I love you. Okay? This person um, possibly wants to kidnap you or would like to. Like, so I'm picking up on, like, that scene in, uh, what is the name of that movie? Clarice. Hannibal Lecter. Silence of the Lambs. Silence of the Lambs, where he puts the girl, it rubs lotion on its skin type shit. This bitch wants to wear your skin. Another one of these skinwalkers. This could be a skinwalker now. This person could have the skinwalker energy, but this bitch wants to wear your skin, male or female. Take that energy as it resonates. I don't know. In the reverse, it means by the music of your design, this will be a triumph. This is what this person thinks. The music, the music of your their design. Well, that's magic. Music of this person can listen to a lot of music. This person could, I just heard, do a lot of conjuring with a very particular style of music. Possibly a style of music that um, is associated with whatever kind of rituals they do. So if somebody's doing Santeria, they could be doing, you know, listening to, some, to like some Hispanic music. I think that's what it is, anyways. Or like Santoria, I don't know. I don't do that. I don't I wouldn't know. So no disrespect to anybody out there. But I think that's like more Spanish or like Caribbean kind of music. I could I could be right or wrong there. This person uses music as a way to divinate to conjure up certain spirits or elements. I just said elements, so Okay. Let's see. Can I get a demon card please? The high priestess in the reverse. I can't make it up. <laughs> okay. A dark witch. Teaches art and science. Knows the secret thoughts of all and can change them. Causes love. Shows vision of the world. Tempts to steal. Tempts thieves to steal. Serves as an excellent familiar. The fool. I cannot make this shit up. The fool in the reverse. Again, y'all. And the Knight of Wands, the kind of action that this person is taking. We got the Seven of Wands, though, which talks about things being blocked. So it's been blocked. It's, I'm telling you, this, this is not going to work, but this is what they're doing. Causes murder and blood shells, sh blood sheds, blood sheds, tales of things to come. Causes the love of friends or enemies. Can make one invisible. I told you this person is dipping off behind the scenes, but this is the kind of magic that this person is sending your way. And it's going to go back. Okay. But we have a, a Valifor, the Four of Pentacles, tempts thieves to steal. This person is a thief. Okay? The, the Dark High Priestess, okay? This person's trying to steal your gifts. That's what I heard. We got the Fool out here, which turned to Aries, okay? Gives understanding of animals and the voice of the waters. Answers, to, answers things to come. This person uses familiars. So, this person could use cats. I heard sacrifices cats as well. Okay? This person likes to sacrifice animals or has or will. But that's the fool in the reverse. In Aries energy. I can't make this shit up. You know, people think I'd be attacking certain types of... No, but this is what the cards are saying. And if it came out in the upright, then we take it in the upright. But it's coming out in the reverse. Oh, God, Lee. Teaches the value of herbs and stones. Transports anyone suddenly from one place to another. I'm telling you, this person wants to kidnap you or has set up, maybe possibly trying to set up some type of kidnapping is what I just heard. This person want, no longer wants you anywhere around unless it's in their dungeon. In this five, where is it, what did it say? Five feet under in the, in the, in the basement. Okay. This person isn't alone either. I just heard. This person is not alone. Okay? Let's get past life out here and then I'll pull on some... What's the T and then we'll get some tarot. 
1500 when I look down. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Select the all option so that you know when all my uploads upload. You feel me? My, 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 my speech pattern, my, my accent be changing, don't it? So we're talking about here, uh, 1240, it's 12.45 p.m. on uh, April 14th, okay? We're still in Aries season. We're approaching Taurus season in a few days here. I feel like because this person is in Aries, I feel like this person is like they're at their I don't know what they how they would justify that or how this works. But because it's airy season, I feel like this person is using every bit of airy season to do all of this dumbass shit with the fool in the reverse. Literally dumbass shit. Let me get another card, please. This person is, um, we got Egypt in the reverse. Anytime like the Egyptian bloodline, the Egyptian card comes out, uh, it tells me that somebody is, either has some type of Egyptian roots or they don't. This person in the reverse does not, but they want to. Knighthood, okay? This person is operating in some type of, like, this person wants to be, I don't understand this energy. Male, female. This person, this has something to do with this. This has something to do with a man or a woman. It definitely does. Love life and then male, female, knighthood. Knighthood means what? Like Templar knight. So this person could be a part of some, some type of coven or secret society. Okay. The Illuminati is actually a Jesuit. I'm sorry. Jesuit. Jesuits. Jesuits are people that protected. Don't get Alexa, what's a Jesuit? A Jezebel is a woman who is considered impure or sinful. The name Jezebel has been used to refer to women who are seen as promiscuous or immoral. The term is often used to criticize women who are outspoken or independent. Did that answer your question? Yes. Thanks for your feedback. So this bitch is Jezebel too. This a, is a woman, okay? <laughs> Alexa, what is it? Jesuit, Jesuit. The Jesuit is a member of the Society of Jesus, a religious order of the Catholic Church. The Society of Jesus, founded by St. Ignatius of Loyola, is a pontifical right order for men. They are headquartered in Rome and are dedicated to the service of the church and humanity. Thank you. You are so very welcome. Hope you're having a good weekend. This person is working for some type of order or society. They just are. They've been charged with a very particular at one time. See, I just heard at one time because the obsession card is out here. I feel like this person has been told to stop. But this person can't stop because of some masculine or feminine energy that loves you or does not love them or because they love some masculine or feminine energy. Or maybe they love your masculine and feminine energy. That's why they want to wear your fucking skin. This is a Jezebel spirit. Jezebel spirits jump into people. Okay? This person is being operated by a spirit at this point. The knighthood tells me that this person was a part of some type of secret society. And I keep saying was because I feel like this person, from what I'm hearing, has been told to stop. They've been told to stop and they can't because they are obsessed with you. I just heard, why them, not me? Well, because you're a Jezebel, okay? And you're a dark witch, okay? And you're doing dark magic. What's the tea on this Jezebel energy, please? I'm seeing the color, I mean, red, red, red. I'm not even seeing that this I'm seeing that this person probably wears a lot of black, but doesn't because the sparrow on the porch doesn't even moving on. This person cannot move on, moving on in the reverse. Thank you. Next. This person is not moving on. This person is, I told you obsessed. Fake accounts. Okay? Fake social media, accounts to spy, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, etc. This person is stalking you on fake accounts. They can't move on. This person is obsessed, okay?
One more. Thank you. I'm telling you, into you. This person, all this is up. This is obsessive energy. This person, this is some weird ass shit. This is fucking weird. Okay. I'm starting to get irritated now because it's weird. The, the links that people will go to because they're not you. It's weird as fuck. Okay. I feel like there's a group of these bitches. But this one won't refuses to let it go. Everybody else just, they, they're under fake accounts. They harass you. But this person has made it their job. This is their job duty. This is what this person is doing now, though. This person is sending out, conjuring up, probably, I heard, listening to some reggae music is what I just heard. Sitting around, conjuring up demons, or conjuring up spirits, or ancestors, or whatever the fuck this bitch is doing, is sending it, the energy your way. Okay? Doing it behind the shadows. Okay. Let's get some energy in there. What else is this person doing now? They're not alone though. They're not alone. They're, they're, they're judgment. There's some, there's some judgment going on right now. I told you. For these people. There's three of them. There's three people doing work right now. And they're under, under heavy judgment for this shit. They are under judgment. Because they refuse to move on. So, um, if we're looking at this, this looks like, again, the rapture. Okay? They're about to leave this earth. Somebody is. There's one, two, three people. I'm telling you, three people for doing this work. They're about to be put out of their misery. Okay? With the nine of swords in the reverse. Somebody's, but they're about to be put out of their misery. Either they're about to be blocked spiritually. That could, that could be what this means. But judgment with those corpses there tells me that somebody either looks like that, okay? Look like Skeletor and shit from what I heard. Or or, or this person, these people. Because there's three people, three swords, three people being taken out of their, their souls are being taken out of their body. One of them definitely, though, I feel like is about to, to have some type of experience, some type of near-death experience. This I can't make it up. The emperor in the reverse, this, this feminine energy. This female inner emperor energy, this this toxic Aries, okay. She's about to be put out of her misery. Completion, okay. Because she won't let go, but they're go she's gonna be forced to let go, and she's gonna be heavily burdened because of this. I'm telling you, the secret society has let her go. That's what happened. They weren't even expecting that shit. They saw that this person was greedy and was willing to do anything necessary to take you out. And it's bad business. I keep telling you these people, okay, they ghosted her. The partnership. They no longer want it. They started to look into what she was doing, I feel like. And they started to look into like, well, is this good for is this good for us? Is this good for us that this person is willing to do whatever it takes to, you know, get they, they, this bitch is getting us all in trouble because of her obsession with this feminine masculine energy. Or this man or this woman. This is about obsession. This this all goes back to a man or a woman. Okay? That's why this person refuses to move on. Why why them, not me? Because you're a fucking witch. I mean, for real. This is how you got to know that people are fucking deluded. I'm even hearing that this masculine energy, because it is a masculine that told this, this female... I'm even hearing that this masculine energy, the king of wands, okay? I'm telling you that. He said, I don't want to do this with you anymore. This is done. I'm done. I'm done. We're not moving. This is not this is not moving forward. We're, we're no longer, I'm no longer fucking your ass. We're not going anywhere. I'm done with this devil ass energy that you're in. I'm moving forward. That's why he already told I don't want the relationship anymore. It's just bad. It's this the, the six of bad memories. That's all this person has with this queen of cups. This person could possibly have children with this person. Maybe or maybe not, but he does not. He does not view this woman anymore as the queen of cups. She is a fucking incubus, succubus, succubus, Jezebel energy. Nothing but bad memories. Okay, it's a toxic situation. He told her, "I'm moving on." Communicated that to her, 
and now she's in regret. Now she wants to start doing magic against you and him, I just heard. Because she feels like this is going to be, this is, how, this is what she's going to do to win, but she doesn't even see it coming. Mm -mm. This person's going to get hit with some type of illness for doing all this magic. I cannot make it up with the, with the high priestess here. Going to be weakened. Okay? Going to be stopped as well. All right. What else? 25, 25 on the clock. What else? The two of one, the two of the two of um, pentacles. Yeah, he poured the cup out. He didn't want to deal with it anymore. It was, it was creating too many imbalances. He did not want to deal with this anymore. He didn't want to be sacrificed either, because that's what she was planning on doing, all in the sake of love. Mm -hmm. She was gonna sacrifice his ass, offer him right up. Page, page of pentacles. I'm trying to tell you, this is what she was doing. Or this is what she no, this is what she was doing. He realized that though. The hangman talks about enlightenment, but in the reverse, it also talks about not being sacrificed. Okay, he was not. He was did not want to be. He dropped it like I dropped her like a bad fucking habit when he found out what she was had been planning, planning, planting. She might have been planting some type of evidence on him. I just heard. She planted something, but she also planted seeds for his sacrifice or his destruction. All in the all in the sake of all in the name of love. Spirit says that's the truth, okay? Probably did some type of love spell that wore off. Cause once somebody gets to a certain level of ascension, this shit don't work. This person ascended, okay? This person ascended and she's mad about that shit. When he was in a low vibration, she was happy. He was not though. Okay? He couldn't get away from this bitch from what I just heard, okay? <laughs> man spirit guides be petty spirit god said that my cat my that my cat my cat with her first litter of kittens is gonna be a better mother than this bitch damn because cats naturally when they have kids are naturally turned into mothers this person had kids and did not and naturally did not turn into a mother damn that's fucked up that 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 a, that a cat a two-year-old cat is a better mother than this person. That's what I heard. Damn spirit. Yeah, this person thinks they're very slick. Mm hmm With their lies, all they do is lie. Mm-hmm. All they do is lie. <laughs> to block shit. They lied. They lied so something wouldn't happen. So that they would so so that this I'm telling you, this nigga, this nigga poured out that cup from this family unit. He no longer wanted it. It took him a long time, but when he finally came to, he acted fast and closed out this cycle, which, um, which, which, um, which, uh, you know, it, it um, removed the blockages towards his will of fortune. It was fated to happen this way. And what happened to her and her friends? I told you she wasn't alone. So she might have sisters. Okay. So she's not alone. She's with her sisters right now. I just heard she could be with her sisters, two of them. Yeah. Now they're all in out in the code. They're broke now. Left out in the cold. There she goes. Because he put her, he blocked her. Things that she's doing is being blocked. Because he saw through the illusions of who she truly is. Spirit says that's the truth. She was only around for the dough. Or he spent a lot of money. But overall, again, this talks about somebody that's not a good housewife, not a good mother, not good with money, not good with business. He saw through the illusions of all this. Spirit says that's the truth. And the baby ain't even his. Okay? Baby ain't even his. There he goes again. The king of pentacles. Gets a brand new passionate beginning. And he ain't telling her shit. He ain't telling her nothing about his brand new passionate beginning. And she can't let it go. She refuses to walk away. She confirmation over over his dead body. You see that blood spilled, but it's not gonna work. Okay. Closing message. Okay. Closing message. What's going to happen to this? Um, 
Well, whatever whatever this person is trying to conjure up is not going to come through with the page of, with the page of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. The manifestation, whatever they're trying to manifest, is not going to come to fruition. Is what I just heard. We got the page of staffs. This person's going to get caught. Good news. There's Empress energy. I told you. And her and her sisters are going to get caught. They're not going to sell off to Karma Waters. Okay. That's good news for you. Good news for you, masculine, feminine, whoever you are out there. You're going to receive some good news about this. Or there's some, you know, you're going to hear about it anyway. I don't even know if you give a fuck. But yeah, you're going to get some good news. This person about them being slick. Good news about this empress. This this person. Okay. Her and her sisters. Okay. So the three of them. Okay. Will not be selling off to Karma Waters. Confirmation. It's not going to happen. Closing messages. Knight of Staffs, okay? They're pissed. They're pissed that they... That she's pissed because it's being laid to rest, okay? She's still trying to send out this magic, though, to attack somebody, okay? She is. She's pissed. That's why she's pissed. She knows what's happening. There's an ending coming. She's prob She probably already got some kind of illness, though, dead ass. Closing messages. She's stuck. Six of Cups to the hangman. She's stuck. Her past is catching up with her. She's stuck. It's all catching up with her. She knows it's going to... The four the four of staffs in the reverse. The six of staffs in the reverse. Magic backfire. That's what's coming her way. Mm -hmm. Confirmation. It's going to be a big fat fail. And it's going to ruin everything for her and her sisters. The, two, the four of staffs. I'm trying to tell you this here. Whatever foundation, whatever home... Whatever kind of celebration is over. Magic backfire. That's what's coming her way. This black magic is being returned with the two of staffs here. Close the message. She ain't going to be able to get away from it. The world, the five of cups, a world full of regret. This is just the beginning of her of, of this karmic cycle. See, she's stuck in a loop. Obsession. She's stuck. She's forever. I just heard she's forever going to be stuck in regret. Okay? For her choices. The world in the reverse talks about the cycle never coming to a close or not coming to a close. But this means that she's she's stuck. She's stuck. She's going to be stuck in a loop from what I with the eight of cups here with the eight too. This is just she's going to be stuck in a constant cycle of her of these regrets coming back to haunt her. Okay? She's vulnerable. I told you she's probably sick too with the nine of staffs. She's not gonna be. She's not gonna be able. She's not gonna be able to to withstand to take what she sent out. The nine of staffs. She's not gonna be able to take it. She could have done this at nine times this morning. <laughs> One more, please. One more. One more. One more. One more. Oh. I can't make it up. The Emperor out here again. That's the Aries card. Ten of Swords. Done deal. Damn. With the moon. I gotta I gotta read it. The moon. Secrets. He's still keeping it a secret. She's trying to figure this out. She's trying to figure out what his next move is going to be. She's not going to be able to figure it out. Here she goes. The Aries again. I can't make it up. Because now she's broke. Now she's pressed in stress. Because she doesn't have. Spirit says that's true. She doesn't have any money. That's her life. Page of Cups. That's her life now. No money. For her foolish accent, action. This month. With the full card again. This Aries energy. Is now broke. Going to be broke. Or is broke. And possibly going to jail. Okay? But this person is, is stressed the fuck out. Because they don't have any money. Possibly pregnant. Well, not it ain't his baby, though. She could possibly be pregnant. Tower. With a fortune. She got to gotta let go. She's got to let go. Of this lie. 
this this person's going to jail. This person is going to jail. She definitely is going to jail. The Will of Fortune talks about things being faded. This was faded to happen. Now this person has to let go of these lies about however she's telling everybody she is or why she's single or what happened between them two. That's what I just heard. Okay? This person has been lying about what why they're single, why 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 this person left her alone. This person could possibly be telling people that she left this person. You feel me? Spirit says that is the truth. This person is going to jail because they are under judgment. That's going to be the judgment. This person is going to be either in a spiritual jail or a physical jail or dead. Okay? There goes the devil. The devil called her back home. The devil called it. I want what's mine. Okay? The devil called judgment. This person already gave up their soul. So that so that so that rapture, that that whole kind of the soul leaving the body, I know it was floating upward, but flip it round. It's floating downward. The devil literally blew that trumpet of judgment on this person. Now they're trapped. That is the end of this message. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Select the all options so that you know when all my uploads upload. You feel me? I'm closing out this reading. Just make sure because, you know, bitches is sending out them magic and portals and all kind of shit. Nope. Closing out that portal. Okay? <laughs> I'm your Uncle 79, the Spiritual Savage. Remember, you grow, I grow, I grow, you grow, we grow together. It's always love and light around this here, bitch. As always, take it easy. I love you. Deuces.